In more local news, when you think of Siegfried and Roy, magicians who occupied the strip for more than four decades, a photo that we're about to show you does not come to mind. This uh, is the Alibaba apartment complex. It's owned by Siegfried and Roy and a friend named Annie Nuna. Neighbors started an online petition to tear the apartment complex down. They say it's a den of prostitution, drugs, and crime. Fox 5 Cindy Lunderberg went to the property and talked to Metro Police. The Alibaba apartment complex is on Deco Lane, just a few streets behind the MGM. Girls getting attacked. Three times as a tenant, I had to get out of bed, run over there, and save some poor girl from being accosted. This is the man who contacted us about the complex, Jimmy Lawrence. He manages the apartments right next door. People come here to buy their drugs, and then they go right next door to do their drugs in some small corner of my property. He said any time of the day or night, there is someone selling or doing drugs. Yeah, there you go, right there. That's a great example of the issue. Uh, that is not a, that address, that is never addressed here. I mean, either Siegfried and Roy and Andy Noonan can put a little money and effort into it or tear it down. Jimmy has started an online petition to do just that. He says he's at his wit's end, and he says he and others have contacted police, county commissioners, and even the Alibaba's apartment manager. While we were here getting a video for this story, the apartment manager here called the police on me, so when the Metro officer arrived, I asked him about this complex. He said he thinks it should be torn down. He said it's constantly full of pimps, drug dealers, and prostitution. I wanted to give that manager the opportunity to speak. Hi, are you the manager? The apartment manager is Alvaro, and he told me it's not true what people are saying about his tenants, and he said he could prove it. Hello, people want to see how the people live in We spoke to Cindy and Bruce. They say they've lived here for years. Do you feel safe here, Cindy? Do I feel safe? I have no problem. You know, you don't like the elements, then get out of it. If this place was demolished, where would everybody go? It's hard. I also reached out to Metro Police. They told me crime in this area is a problem, and it's not just a problem at this complex. They say in the past year, they had 35 calls to the Alibaba's apartments. They say the last major incident was a barricade situation in 2017. Sergeant Jivapong, who oversees this area command, says if anything were to be torn down, he doesn't see it happening for five to ten years. In the meantime, Jimmy says he plans to take matters into his own hands. I guess the only thing that I could say to someone else who doesn't live in this area, you never know when your car might break down in this neighborhood. The people who uh, say that is not true. Nice people living here, old people for years living here, and I don't have no problems.